Pitch Control is an Avid AAX MIDI plugin that lets you take incoming MIDI note data in velocity or pitch ranges and transpose them in various creative ways. MIDI plugins are now part of Pro Tools instrument tracks and allow you to manipulate incoming MIDI data in real time. And Pitch Control is included with all Pro Tools offerings from intro up to ultimate. This video will demonstrate some ways that Pitch Control can be used. Let's look at the controls for pitch control. The plugin has two sections, range and control. Range lets you select the incoming note data either by velocity of the notes or the note pitches themselves. Either can be set to only, which is a defined range, or all except, which excludes the range in the setting. For control, you have four different options. Transposed by octaves or semitones will transpose the notes by the octave and or semitones. They can be used together and the octave range can be set plus or minus 10 octaves. Transpose from note to note allows you to transpose the notes as defined by the difference between the two values. Set all the notes to a particular note takes all incoming note data and transposes it to the set value. And quantize the session key and scale steps will look at the key of the session and play the incoming notes within the scale of the session key. You can always check to see what each of these parameters do by hovering your pointer over the function and see the tool tip at the bottom of the plugin window. In our first example, we want to quickly create a kick drum track based on the pattern of the bass part. First, we will copy the MIDI clip from the bass track to the kick track. The part will need to be edited so that all the notes trigger just the kick drum in the boom kit. Pitch Control will allow us to quickly do this without extensive editing. Open the Pitch Control plugin and set the pitch range from C-2 to G-3. This will ensure we only have the kick play with the lower notes of the bass part. Then under Control, select Set All Notes to and set the value to C-1. Now when this track is played, all the notes between C-2 and G-3 are playing the C-1 kick drum in the same rhythm as the bass track. We can further tweak the track by adjusting the real-time properties velocity values to have the kick drum sit better in the mix. You can use different Pro Tools MIDI plugins together to achieve complex results. One example is to use both note stack and pitch control to create a key constrained harmony part from a simple melody line. First, we will have NoteStack create both the original note and a major third above with its velocity set at 90%. If we just use NoteStack, you'll hear that the line does not sound correct for the major key that it is in. To get the line in the correct key, we will add the Pitch Control plugin and set the control section to quantize to session key in zero steps. The plugin will look to the key the session is set to and constrain all the notes to the proper scale. Now when played, the harmony line is played correctly in the D major scale without having to manually edit the data. 